My name is Ernest Siazi. I'm from uh, New Mexico, a place called Nas City. This is a, this a nice, close to Tehachi, New Mexico. I went to school in Albuquerque, New Mexico Indian School. In 1942, I graduated. I joined the United States Marine Corps. Stayed there almost a year. Then it was the they started shipping us overseas in 1943. There's, there was about 30 or 40 coat talkers, including me. Just bought a ship there from San Diego. They, sh they ship us clear down to uh, New Caledonia. That's right close to Australia. I took my training with those, those, those uh, Navajo kid boys in, from the from Second World Battalion. They were aiding there, so I joined them. They teach me how to talk. But our first combat was Guan. Only oh, there was only six Navajo. Eight with me. They, they, they would just take us apart. There was two of us. We used to wonder, you, you turn it like this, like that. That's how they make signals to you. There was about three Marine Division and three Marine Army for that Guan campaign. It only took us all oh, about three weeks to take it. We, after it was over, we went back to Guan. That's where, where our resting camp is. Then a year later, they tell us we're going to, go, we're going to Okinawa. On April Fool Day, take us 81 days to take that island. That's quite a bit. We used to send messages in our own language. Now, boy, we could hear those Japanese men. Make them sorry that they, they couldn't understand it. That's about it. Then they release us and send us home. And they are not going yeah, it's a little one.